with DC, I got the Flashpoint Beyond issue number one, but I prefer to have the variant cover by Zermanico. I think this was fantastic work. Let me put that light up. Oh, yeah. It's clean. That is tough right there. Yeah. Always on fire with those. Uh, yeah, that's probably the yeah. B cover. As, huh? as much as they always want the A cover to be like such a big deal, like, you know, they always learn you in with the fantastic quality of work they put in with these car stock um, B covers for DC. That's where it's at for me. Um, so I also grabbed Nubia issue number one, the cur coronation special, which is her origin. So, you know, oh, yeah. having that Amazon trial and now it's Amazon's aftermath, um, conclusion to the trial of the Amazonians, but, um, I was, I was really tempted to get the, the B cover. Cause I thought it was fire, but this one was also very like had a really nice artsy um, touch to it. Yeah, that was yeah, for sure. You no, know, to the checkout. This one is from last week, but I had it on hold because I didn't want to. Um, I'm trying to budget my shopping now and start looking for more um, keys and silver ages and you know grails. Oh yeah, um, over time. So Detective Comics issue number ten fifty nine. Once again, the variant, and this one's by Lee Bermig Joe. Now, one thing I like about DC now is they're, they're putting the credits on the variant so that you don't have to like, look it up, you know? Okay. Right on the bottom. And yeah. I can tell a Lee Bermejo cover from a mile away, and that brother gets it in. Yeah, I remember he did a Catwoman oh. um variant that he's i been have doing, he's been doing all the dc detective comics variants yeah he's killing all of them Brilliant. every one of them is crazy dark you know what i mean that it, it fits that that gotham feel 